to the power of God, I, I don't know, but there are people God is raising to become mighty vessels. I just saw an anointing rest on you, this role. In the name of Jesus, I don't know where you are, but I pray may that grace now, let it rest upon you and shift you to a new dimension. In the name of Jesus Christ. Welcome to Christocentric Message. On this channel, you are going to get soul-lifting messages, faith-based content, prayer drills, and videos that would help you grow spiritually. Remember to subscribe to the channel, like the video you are about to watch, and comment on it. Stay blessed. Everyone, please begin to pray. Mention the things that you desire for God to do in your life tonight. Go ahead and pray. Please pray. Everyone pray. We're here for a miracle service. Holy Spirit, Thou art welcome in this place. Holy Spirit, Thou art welcome in this place. Omnipotent Father of mercy and grace, Thou art welcome in this place are you praying holy spirit thou art welcome in this place holy spirit thou art welcome in this place omnipotent father of mercy and grace thou art welcome in this place for you are glorious and worthy to be praised you are the lamb upon the throne and on to you we lift our hands in praise you are the lamb upon there are cries of adoration i see men from every nation lift their voice to make your glory known singing holy 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 are you lord holy 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 are you lord the saints and the angels bow the redeemed worship you now holy 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 are you lord please rise up on your feet everyone lift your hands to jesus holy 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 are you lord holy 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 are you The saints and the angels bow, the redeemed worship you now. Holy, holy, holy are you, Lord. The saints and the angels bow, the redeemed worship you now. Holy, holy, holy are you, Lord. The saints and the angels bow. The redeemed worship you now. Holy, holy, holy. Now, just two instructions very quickly and then we'll be very fast. Please listen. I want the ushers and all those to collect the prayer requests. 
please if you are here it's usually our culture when we come for the miracle service to write down our expectations in a prayer request and if you are yet to do that let me just give you a minute very quickly to do that those following online if you're yet to submit your prayer request from across the nations of the earth please do that very quickly you can send it and let's call it everything right away you can have a minute or two to do that very quickly or in case you've written yours but for some reason your doubt and your fear did not allow you to include certain things now under this atmosphere of faith do well to write and add because everything you have written in the name of jesus will become your testimony now when you write that here's what i want you to do so that we maximize time i'd like you when you're done to pass it to the last person either at the left or right i'll just pass it to someone and they lift it up so that it makes it easy for the ushers no one is reading your prayer request is between you and the lord jesus once you are done please pass it very quickly so that the ushers can have it and if they are yet to come to your area just be patient now there are three things that i'm going to do very quickly and i want you to participate maximally in all of them number one is the prayer of deliverance what is deliverance deliverance is a spiritual activity that separates you from every influence that impedes your advancement it could be a spirit influence or it could be a situation it doesn't necessarily have to do with separating you from a spirit even though most of the times it is spirit related but there are influences that have refused to allow us to make progress and i'm about to rebuke those spirits and rebuke those influences that's number one will take out time to minister because i can tell you this most of the things you have written in your prayer request it is this stage of this ministration that will solve them when the spirit influences that are back of these things are lifted from your life you will find out that doors begin to open supernaturally number two number two i'm going to be ministering to the sick by the power of the holy spirit and please listen to me if you came here expecting healing whether for yourself or for your loved one i want you to release your faith as i make declarations by the spirit of god remember my teaching i want you to connect by faith and somewhere in the course of the service we're going to give an opportunity for those who have been marvelously touched by the hand of god and it's not just those who have been healed from sicknesses alone those who have been delivered even when you stand up when you are brought out don't just stand up and walk away something would have happened to you note what has happened to you and when it is time some of you can have visionary encounters even while the meeting is going on all kinds of supernatural activities that is the second thing i will minister to the sick concurrently as this is happening the third would be the prophetic even though because of time many times we limit this operation as I speak to you and declare over you I want you to believe with all your heart I have taught you here that the prophetic is both revelatory and creative the revelatory dimension of the prophetic brings you comfort it brings you direction it builds your faith the creative dimension of the prophetic makes things to manifest that have no business manifesting are we together now and so we're going to have this and then pray and then we'll be done please i'd like you to open up your heart and allow this experience to be a rich one especially if this is your first time coming for koinonia let it be an experience that no one will tell you about let your heart be open this is the time of the meeting where there should be no distractions whatsoever your heart should be opened and then you receive hallelujah praise the name of the lord and so I'm going to pray for you right now. As always, there are spirits that remain dogged over tying down the destinies of men. Coming to you as dreams, coming to you as visions, coming to you as manifestations, causing delay, causing hardship, causing retrogression. 
embargoes of disfavor resting on people i'm about to pray for you and as i pray for you very quickly the power of god is going to come upon you and ushers please let's let's quickly quickly bring them out in the name of jesus christ hallelujah praise the name of the lord now um please bring the person two people that are going to shout right now loud under the power of god in this auditorium the power of god is coming on two people a very very loud shout bring them please let's pray father in the name that is above all names we have come here you have called it a miracle service a service where you are taking burdens yokes from the destinies of men lord there are people here who have been tied down by all kinds of things some of them have prayed some of them have fasted some of them have done everything they know to do and it looks like it is not going but lord i thank you because you have, you have been given a name that is above every other name above thrones above dominions every name that is named and as your people shout at the count of three i'm going to ask you to shout the name jesus hear me i tell you there is fire burning here as you shout that name inside and outside the power of god is going to rest upon you and everything that is not of the christ must leave your destiny now right now in the name of jesus at the count of three together we will shout that name that is above every other name and every wall of jericho must go down are you ready one two three shout jesus now every stranger every foul spirit go now come out of their destinies now in the name of jesus please bring them out very quickly i decree and declare lose them now and let them go lose their destinies now by the fire of the holy ghost lose them now and let them go in the name of jesus while still praying there are families that have been tied down that nothing good will come out of you right now i decree and declare i'm seeing at least 21 people belonging to this case by the power that raised christ from the dead one more time you will shout jesus may that fire rest upon you every altar that is speaking against your family that you will not rise that you will not shine it is destroyed right now one two three shout jesus in the name of jesus be destroyed be destroyed every embargo of darkness in the name of jesus please bring them out by the power of the holy ghost never the same never the same never the same in the name of jesus i'm praying look at me please there are people i'm seeing in the spirit who have this embargo of disfavor now you are moving physically you may not see it but there is an embargo on you people and things that should help you just ignore you as if you are not there i don't know who belongs to that category but right now in the name of jesus may that power come upon you now i declare that that yoke that embargo of this favor upon your life is broken now 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 Hananta Shadaba Lakoto Soto Badakata Kratiga de Bakata. I'm still seeing fire fall on people. I'm still seeing fire fall on people. The Lord is, is focusing on families right now. I'm saying it again. Every family that has not advanced, you have done the best you know to do. Educated but not advancing. Exposed but not advancing. Surrounded by helpers but not advancing. At the count of three. As you shout that name i decree and declare everything sitting on the advancement of your family it must be cleared out of the way 
are you ready don't be tired one two three shout jesus those barriers be broken help them please my god help that gentleman be broken now be broken now be broken now please help the ushers whether you are an usher or not they are overwhelmed if someone is near you just help to bring them out please help the ushers in the marvelous name of jesus listen to me i want to pray for you i want to pray for you there are families that have not experienced ease the things that should be easy there are others for 10 years they are trying to build one house 10 years and it's not like they are lazy everything they try to do it looks like there is no way i am praying for you there's a reason why i ask you to bring them out please help us and ministering to them in the name of jesus the spirit of retrogression that is sitting on anyone apakatoskata Madika Parukata Kebrendegeta. Right now, I command that spirit in the name of Jesus. Let them go now. Let them go now. Let them go now. Let Apakatosh Kadebakata. Let them go now. Bring them out. Let them go now. Please bring them out. Now watch this. There was a woman in the Bible that all the men in their life, her life were dying mysteriously. She was called the widow at Nain. The husband that she had mysteriously died. The last son that represented her future also died. And while they were taking him out of the gate, Jesus stopped them and said, no, it's not over. What in the world is happening here? The man who would grant us strength and security and fortification. There is this, this lady waving her hands. That one. I'm seeing oil coming on your head, my dear. Right now I decree and declare. Be released now. In the name of Jesus Christ. Now be released by the power of the Holy Spirit. Who is like him, lion and the lamb, seated on the throne? Mountains bow down, every ocean roll to the Lord of Lords. Hallelujah. Hear me. The Holy Ghost is still telling me to rebuke the spirit of death. You see, you keep me keep saying this thing. This embargo of the grave in the name of Jesus Christ. If there is anyone here appointed to death, that there is an embargo of death, that you will not see the end of the year. All your family members are bakadoshkata. Some of you have seen it in dreams. You lie down to sleep and the semblance of death comes by the power of the Holy Ghost. Right now, may the fire of God rest upon you and bring an end to the orchestrations of death. Right now, in the name of Jesus, be delivered from the sword, be delivered from accidents, be delivered from terrorism. Joseph, who is Joseph? I'm hearing a name, Joseph. Joseph, this is what I'm hearing. I presume there may be many people with that name. Joseph. Where are you from? Where are you from? Please don't just come out at random or pray. I can imagine how many Josephs will come out. 
Now, please hear me. Where are you from, my friend? Huh? Shout Jesus as loud as you can. Out of his life forever. In the name of Jesus Christ. Please don't come out at random, man, so that we can walk with time. There are two of you here that have the call of God on your life. Fire is coming on you now. The Lord is saying it's a new dimension in ministry. Among the Josephs that are here, in the name of Jesus Christ, new level, new level, new dimension. By the power of the Holy Spirit, you are drinking of a very strong wine. Parakatosh katiba lakata. In the mighty and marvelous name of Jesus. New grace. Kadish kadibala. In the name of Jesus Christ. Kogi State. Who is Halima? I'm hearing the name Halima. It's like you are from Kogi State. Is there someone like that i want to pray for you for all of you that what's your name where are you from come stand here you are in abuja here i want what do you do i want to pray for you because god is bringing deliverance to your family i don't know you i don't know anything about you but I want to pray for you in the name of Jesus Christ by the power of the Holy Spirit I declare that it is a new season right now who is innocent innocent I'm hearing the name innocent your name is innocent 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 Who is innocent? The man I'm seeing is, a, is I'm, I don't know if you're an old man, but I'm seeing gray hair. The innocent I'm seeing. You are wearing like a, is it light green or something? Kaftan. Light green. Is there someone like that? Innocent. Your life is about to change. Where is he? Come. Oh, he said, an old man, come. Please let me, I'll, I'll pray for all of you, but where is he coming from? Outside? Are you his wife? Give her the mic. Huh? I'm the wife. Where was he? His name is Innocent. Yes, sir. You're welcome, sir. Please come. <laughs> sir, I want to pray for you. I believe in the power of the Holy Spirit. Madam, I want you to cheer up. God is going to turn your life around. Yeah in a way that will stop no you don't have to kneel please stand i don't know you you see this thing is not like it's a it's human calculate you can't calculate these kinds of things it, it has to be of the spirit praise the lord who works in a bank here bank anyone i'm seeing i just saw the name uba uba this is what i just saw uba that should be the name of a bank is there anyone like that? Not, not just in front here. UBA. Oh. UBA. The Lord is bringing... I will pray for you, but I'm seeing a gentleman. It's not a lady I'm seeing, but then I will pray for you. In the name of Jesus Christ. By the power of the Holy Spirit, let there be increase for you. Right now, in the name of Jesus Christ, supernatural increase by the power of the Holy Spirit. Baba, let me pray for you and your dear wife and then I'll pray for everyone. Innocent too, sir. Okay, I'll pray for you. Um, there's someone here, don't be embarrassed. I'm not calling him bad but your brother has been stealing like there's the spirit of theft the house is tired everybody is tired god wants to deliver him now who is that person this boy has been stealing there is if you hide anything anywhere it's like word of knowledge where who is that please 
please don't come out here if we're, we're serious don't no don't stop them if, um if if you are the one don't worry god will touch you we're going to make um, um please let's just be sure that we're i'm not saying you suspect he's a thief or a car. he's somebody that everybody including him you know that they are stealing this thing is a spirit can i tell you this once people cannot control certain things, even though they know it's wrong it's a spirit are we together now you see how these evil spirits work you hide money they will steal it they come out of prison they go back again i know a gentleman years ago who his mother cost him that until rat stop stealing he will not stop stealing yes sir when when he gets to the prison they don't even ask him a question he will just go in because they already know that this guy is there they come and bail him out you mean all these people are you the ones who have is it that it's a challenge you hold on please let's let's time is against us so we have to make sure we our efforts are not wasted praise god is it that you are the one who is struggling with it no problem there's huh all of you your brothers they steal now you look at this ladies and gentlemen how in the world do you survive with these kinds of things now it does not always mean that the people are bad it's a spirit i'm going to pray for you and for some of you let me tell you this i don't mean to scare you but if it's happening to more than one or two or three people in your family chances are that you may also be a victim of it because it's a pattern like don't be embarrassed but two of you now as i'm speaking the power of god is going to come on you and you'll be delivered from this same thing now even before your loved ones just believe i'm a man of god i'm like a, a doctor once you lie down on the bed of surgery you don't tell the doctor what to do you just lie down and let them operate you once they are done they will ask you to come up two of you the power of god is called, i just saw that light because some of you it, it, these things they are patterns help them you see it now i'm not saying you are thieves i'm just saying this is a spirit just because it caught someone first does not mean it will leave the rest it will attempt everybody in that family there are two people there's one more this is one one of you the power of god is coming on you you have to be free from this demonic thing if not you will be surprised that one day you will just be a victim of this thing and it will embarrass you somewhere in the name of jesus christ why are they here again please any other person even if is the person stealing himself just stay back and release your faith right there this is a whole family or you are coming from outside okay lift your hands all of you who are in front here please i like you to believe don't condemn your brothers don't condemn anyone daddy let me prophesy to you first please look at me sir in the name of jesus you will not die i'm not a prophet of doom i'm only speaking because i looked at you and the next thing i saw a coffin and the lord is saying i should rebuke it in the name of jesus i don't know whether there's currently an infirmity or whatever it is but may the lord himself preserve you the fullness of your days you will fulfill in the name of jesus and for everyone here for the various reasons why you came out including loved ones who are challenged in this area with any and all forms of addiction i don't this fair lady i keep seeing light all over you i'm seeing the power of god coming on you this lady in the name of jesus christ i decree and declare by the power of the holy spirit something is leaving you i'm seeing that miracle happening to you in the name of jesus be free now not just for you but for your entire family now in the name of jesus christ the son of the living god now everyone who is here wherever your loved ones are who are are victims of this this theft and whatever it is i declare their deliverance now i declare their deliverance now and please hear me let me use this once and pray for anyone here who is under any kind of yoke of addiction different kinds of addictions for you or for your family members in the name that is above all names that power of addiction that seems to have control over you let it be broken now let it be broken now let it be broken now 
let it be broken now in the name of Jesus Christ and for everyone here you will go back and you will return with testimonies in Jesus name I pray God bless you please return rejoicing very quickly Justina okay our time I'm hearing the name Justina who is Justina Justina Where are you coming from? I'm here in Abuja. No, state I'm of. Huh? I want to pray for you. You believe in the power of God? Yes. Sir. Look at me. Your family has been under siege. God wants to bring marvelous deliverance to your family. Lord Jesus, I'm praying. What God says to one, He's saying to everybody. In the name of Jesus, over this family, the power of God is coming on you now. Let there be deliverance now. In the name of Jesus Christ, everything that represents an oppression over this family, it comes to an end in Jesus' name. You too, Justina, can I pray for you? In the name of, what do you do? What do you mean construction? Building maintenance. Where are you from? I'm from Kaduna State. What is the name of the this this Chinese company? CC. The Lord is going to connect you to somebody in that place. Look at me. Believe what I'm telling you. And go to your secret place and write this name down. Sahara. Just write it. Sahara. Go and write it down. A time will come. Somebody, a lady from that place, God is going to connect you to her. And they will lift you. Sahara. That's the name I'm seeing on you. Just go and write it down. This, this is like, this is, this is an, a company that it looks like they're into gas, oil and gas. Go and write it down. Believe what I'm telling you. You just go and write it. Sahara. Go and write the name. In the name of Jesus Christ. May the Lord change your life. May the Lord turn your life around. In Jesus name. All of you, the same thing. Let me pray for you. In the name of Jesus. One of you has severe stomach pain. Like it comes. Who is that person? Severe stomach pain. Place your hand there. Um, what I'm seeing is not good. But in the name of Jesus Christ. I decree and declare every planting that is not of the Lord now let it go in the name of Jesus out of her now in the name of Jesus who is the son of the living God I decree and declare let her be delivered right now and for all of you who are here standing whether for yourselves or your family members in Jesus name let there be liberty now in Jesus name dearly beloved I hope you were blessed by this message do not keep the video to yourself, share to as many as you can to help them bless. Check our homepage for more of our messages, subscribe to the channel, comment on it, like it. See you on our next video. Bye! Pray! Pray! Pray for your destiny! The phase of development. Lord, grant me the discipline.